Hello everybody! This video will show you how to move your Windows from one computer to another without having to reinstall it and keeping all settings, files and installed software. You may need it if you bought a new computer and now you want to move your working operating system there without any changes. Dear friends, if you need to recover deleted data, use Utilities by Hetman Software. Follow the link in the description to visit our website, download a utility for free and install it. Then start disk analysis. When the process is over, it will show the files available for recovery and you will be able to bring them back. Our blog features quick guides to solve all kinds of problems faced by Windows users. Our channel and blog offer solutions for any issues, from installing the operating system to remote administration and connecting mobile devices. Our specialists will be glad to answer your questions in comments to videos and articles. To move your Windows, create a recovery image. You don't need any third-party apps to do it. You can use Windows tools. To do it, Go to Control Panel, File History, System Image Backup, and Create a System Image. In Windows 7, it is Control Panel, Backup and Restore, Create a System Image. Select a media to save the image and click Next. Watch one of our videos for a detailed guide on creating a recovery image and restoring Windows. Find the link in the description. As a result, a complete system image will be created, including all installed applications and programs, files and shortcuts, as well as settings. To use the system image you have just created on another computer, you, you will need a Windows boot or installation disk. In my case, a bootable USB drive will be created, but it can also be a CD or a DVD. Watch another video on our channel to see how to create a bootable USB drive for Windows 7, 10, 8 or 7. Find the link in the description. After that, connect the media containing the system image and the USB bootable drive to the new computer. Boot the computer with the USB drive. To do it, go to BIOS or UFI and set first boot priority to the USB device. Then restart the computer. There is a special video about it. I will give the link in the, in the description. After the computer boots from the USB drive, use it to go to Recover Environment by selecting the menu System Restore. There is a special video about it. Find the link in the description. In the recovery environment, go to Troubleshooting – System Image Recovery. Then follow the wizard directions to recover the system from an image. And the recovery process will start. Wait until it is over. Here is one very important aspect. Transferring Windows from one computer to another is only possible if they have similar interfaces – BIOS and BIOS or UFI and UFI. You can also move the system from a computer with BIOS to a computer with UFI. As all modern computers have UFI, you are not going to have any problems. But if you try to move Windows from a computer with UFI to a computer with BIOS, it will not work. The system image will not be restored and you will see a narrow message saying about incompatibility of different versions of microcode. To learn if you have a BIOS or UFI, watch one of our videos. You will find the link in the description. When the recovery process is successful, the computer will restart and boot the same windows which you used to create this image. System transfer is shown on the example of Windows 10. In Windows 7, your actions will be the same just when you unfold the image on a new PC, the recovery environment interface will be different. In this video, we showed a method based on Windows tools. However, there are many third-party programs for transferring, cloning, creating a system image or backup. They are based on a similar principle. There are both free and fee-paying solutions. For example, free applications are AOMA Backup Standard or MacRim Reflect Free. 
a good alternative, are programs by HDD and SSD manufacturers. Seagate Disk Wizard, Samsung Data Migration, Acronis True Image, Western Digital Edition. But they all work only with disks of their own brands. That is all for now. If you found this video useful, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel to see more. Thank you for watching and good luck!